Alright, welcome back to Taste Panel for Chili Geeks, episode 14. Alright, we have another sauce for you today, and this time we're going to travel way down Mexico way with El Yucateco. Now, I don't even know if I'm pronouncing that right, but uh, for the sake of this show, that's what it's going to be. Alright, anyway, uh, I got this one. Um, at the local Walmart, so uh, this one did not cost me a pretty penny, and I decided to uh, just grab it for the heck of it, to give it a shot, because it looked interesting, and uh, love the pepper on there, so uh, let's take a look at what this guy says, um, alright, hot sauce, salsa picante de chili habanero, el yucateco, all right, there's not too many warnings on here. We have, you get more habanero. All right, we're hoping so. Uh, let's take a look here. Uh, uh, this is a product out of Mexico. Um, it is produced by El Yucateco. Salsa y condimentos, and that is out of Yucatan, Mexico. Okay, makes sense. Now, let's uh, check out the ingredients written here. We have those. This is another one that reads pretty long. So, here we go. Alright, ingredients. Water, habanero pepper, tomato, salt, spices, acetic acid, xanthan gum, Citric acid, sodium benzoate as a preservative, uh, red dye number 40, calcium disodium. Hmm, that sounds pretty scientific, so uh, I don't know, there's no extract, but uh doesn't seem like um, all natural ingredients, but who am I? I'm no scientist, so... Um, yeah, El Yucateco. Um, color looks like a dark red color, and, um, I don't see much in the way of, uh, seeds or anything in there, but, uh, ah, let's give it a go. El Yucateco. Let's cut this guy off of here. Uh, Trusty knife. Okay. Give us a shake. Now this bottle is a little smaller than most, so I can't imagine this is going to be hanging around too long. But while well, we have the opportunity, trusty spoon, and uh, give this a smell. All right. Uh, yeah, kind of a. Uh, pungent pepper smell there. Um, maybe getting a little, a little tomato sweetness of a tomato thing there, and some garlic. So, uh, without further ado, oh yucateco. Okay, kind of pouring with a kind of a medium body here. Again, color bright red, sort of ketchupy looking. Uh, not getting a lot of chunk, or it seems pretty well pureed up. Let's give that to the camera there. Okay. All right, here we go. Hmm. Okay, um, yeah, body very creamy. Um, kind of habaneros are pepper flavors, definitely uh, right up front on that guy. Um, a little bit of the uh, tomatoey flavor going on. Um, Uh, 
Yeah, pepper flavor up front, for sure. Getting a lot of, a uh, lot of, uh, uh, the flavor of the hobs coming through. Um, right now, uh, back of the tongue, back of the throat area, right away, hit me there. Um, getting a creeping burn coming up from the back of my tongue forward to about just shy of my mid tongue. Um, Tiny bit on the tip of my tongue. Um, got a small, small lip burn going kind of across the center of my bottom lip. The heat kind of building even to the sides of my tongue. Um, yeah, warmth going down. Um, Concentrating on the the back of the tongue area, back of the throat, back of the tongue. Um, getting uh, um, lingering uh, garlicky taste in my mouth as well. But the peppers are right there. Really, uh, really uh, strong pepper, pepper flavors. Uh, it says we get more habanero. So, uh, yeah, um, 